What's up, K-Square fam? In this video, I'm going to be making Dalgana coffee, which is like a whipped coffee. And it's something that's been trending all over social media. It's on TikTok, it's on Instagram, it's on Facebook. And as a coffee lover, um, it's only right that I attempt to make it. Granted, I'm not a person that likes to spend time in the kitchen. I'm, I don't like to cook. I know how to cook. I don't enjoy being in the kitchen. But I said, you know what, this is super simple. Let me try it. I have the ingredients here. I'm in quarantine, so I have nothing better to do, hence my attire. This is what I call quarantine attire. Okay, so I'm gonna embrace my inner quarantine and try to, you know, do something that I would never do before. So I'm gonna try to make this whipped coffee. So this recipe calls for some sugar that we have right over here. Um, some Folgers coffee. Well, it could be any instant coffee, but right now we have Folgers. I have 2% milk, cinnamon if we want to add like a little like kick to it, a bowl. I have a whisk because I don't have that fancy bougie machine that, you know, bakers use. Measuring uh, spoons and some boiling water. Let's get on it. So the first thing that I need to do is do two tablespoons of instant coffee. So I got my little one tablespoon right over here. So I'm gonna go in here. Get my coffee. One. And two. Okay. Next, I need to take the sugar and do two tablespoons of sugar. So I'm gonna go right over here. Oh my God, this is harder than it looks to like scoop it up. One. Two. Voila. Next, we need two tablespoons of hot water. As you can see, I boiled some water there. You can see the steam. I'm gonna take two tablespoons of it and put it in the bowl. Now I'm gonna whisk. All right. I'm tired. So I think I whisked this for approximately like between five and seven minutes, like real full speed as fast as I could. And now it's like a nice like cream. It looks so mighty good. Like, mm. So now the next step is we need to get a cup, fill it up with ice, like uh, halfway in the cup, and then fill up the cup with milk about three fourths of the way. And then this goes on the tippy top. So let's see how it goes. Let me get my cup. It's out. Okay. Get ice. enough ice right That's how much ice I have in my cup now milk get my leche and put it inside like that okay it's in the fridge part now we're gonna take the whipped coffee and put it in the cup I feel like it's gonna come out ugly looking not like the you know it looks like on TikTok and all those Pinteresty looking pictures but I'm gonna try my best I'm gonna take a spoon and I'm just gonna put it in there I'll show you when it's done all right so I put it in the cup to be honest, I feel like I needed more whipped coffee because it's not to the tippy top of my cup. But I just followed the instructions, so let me taste it. Hold on. Oh, this is strong. Wow. This is strong as coffee. Like, I'm not a fan of strong coffee. This is how it looks like. Let me show you. Presentation. I give myself like a a B minus. 
voila. It looks pretty yummy, if I do say so myself. It's not cute and bougie like the pictures though, but let's see how it tastes. Are you supposed to mix it? Cause like, this to be honest just tastes like straight up milk and then like with a little topping. So maybe I should like stick it in the milk, right? Maybe, maybe mix it a little bit. Right, right, maybe that's what I was supposed to do. Like, bad not gonna lie it tastes really good after you mix it with like the milk it tastes really good mm. Mm. this is actually really tasty not gonna lie it's really tasty it tastes mm, it tastes really good I would definitely say mix it <clears throat> if you don't mix it you're pretty much just drinking milk with like foam on the top but after I mixed it it was really really good and like if you just eat the the whipped coffee by itself it's strong so if you don't like strong coffee you're not gonna like it just like out the bowl but when you mix it with some milk and with the ice like it tastes mm. this is really good this is I like it I would give this like a an A. Is it better than Starbucks? No. Is it better than Dunkin' Donuts? No. I think maybe next time having a little bit more foam, like not more foam, maybe like doubling the recipe and having more whipped coffee. But like, not bad. Ingredients and the recipe for whipped coffee in the description box below. If you wanna give it a shot, see if maybe you like it. It was pretty easy to do. And it's not that bad. It's okay. If you want me to attempt anything else in the kitchen, you know, and get a little fancy in the kitchen since I got nothing better to do, let me know what you want me to make. Um, like always, subscribe. Click that um, bell button. Give this video a thumbs up. Look at my, my nail. There's no nail. Give this video a thumbs up. Let me know what you're doing during this quarantine period. Are you attempting to make anything that you've never made before? Are you attempting to do anything that you've never done before? I'm curious because, you know, people are really getting creative out here. So let me know what you're doing. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye.